All right, Kelsey, so what are we doing today? So today is the first time we're going to be working with the bees. We're going to put this second brood box on top of that one. So they can start filling this up. So we're going to need to take one of the frames out of this one that's already established and put it in here. And we'll place one of these frames in the bottom one so they can fill that one up. And one of those frames that you're taking out of this one has to have eggs on it, right? Yeah, so it'll have some some um, some brood, it'll have some pollen, and that will help them to know that, you know, the scent is up there and they need to come up and they'll start filling out the rest of the... Uh, that makes the queen go from the bottom up to the next one, right? Yes. Okay. Yep. All right, let's try to do it. <laughs> Don't put that in there. Oh, yes. <laughs> Still getting smoke? Wow. Look at all that. That's that side. And not too much on this side, but it looks like they're working on it. Mm -hmm. So that's that one. So we're going to just set this one right here. Just give them a little bit more. They're really good though. Yeah. I was nervous, but this is all right. Good. Okay. So now we have that one from the end. So now I'm gonna take one from the middle. I'm gonna use the hive tool to kind of separate them because they get real stuck up with honey. I'd like to find the queen, but I don't know if I'm gonna risk doing that. Okay. Excuse me. All right, so let's take one out of here so it's ready. And then we'll go ahead and peel up this one from the middle. And we've definitely got brood and pollen. How interesting. Can you take a picture of that? My phone is in my pocket in my pants. All right. I'm sorry. We'll have to, I'll have to suit up next time. So you're gonna put it in that one, huh? Yes. Okay. That's what you're supposed to do. So there's, there's ones that are capped. Does that mean there's eggs in there? Yeah. Okay. So they're in the new one. All right. Now I'm going to scooch these ones back over. Huh. Scoochy scooch. Try to do it slow so you don't irritate them too, too much. Back in. Excuse me. Almost 
smash anybody. Okay. And now I'm gonna put this new one in. Doesn't have anything on it. Down right here. I don't know if you can see this on the top, but this is called burr comb, and it's just extra, and it's a good idea to scrape that off, because they're not going to be able to do anything with that. But I didn't see the queen this time, but we'll do another inspection next week. So I think I'm going to go ahead and place this on top, and uh, leave them be. Here's our box. Oh yeah. Does that look good? Yeah, looking like a hive now. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, you got one, but you can't help it. I know. Okay, I think it's all even. Maybe I can repair that thing. Okay. That bowed one. All right. That looks better. Yep. Okay. Everyone's good. Just to give you an idea how these bees are, I'm like six feet away from the box right now and I don't have anything on. Haven't got stung. Hopefully I don't jinx myself. So what's that called? This is the uh, telescoping lid. That That's not the telescoping lid. No, this is the migrating. Okay. Because I have this all right. They can get out. I'm gonna put that one back on because there's so many on that one. I'll just take that thing off. Because the only reason that the screen was on there so we didn't lose them was so that we didn't lose the bees. He just had that on there to keep them in. Yeah. Whenever we transported there you go. them. Just rip it off. I'm sorry. Uh oh. <laughs> that got them riled up. Uh -huh. Okay. I got it. So that's a migrating lid. That's for the queen to migrate up through? And everyone else. And, and all of them, okay. And the workers. Yeah, you definitely want to do down there because we're going we're gonna to tear this, uh, what do you call that stuff? This mesh screen. We're going to take that mesh screen off there. That ought to help production too, I would say, because they would be able to get in and out of there oh, easier. Yeah. Okay, big telescoping lids going back on. Telescoping, telescoping, whatever. That looks so good. Oh yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, they'll like that. A little bit more. Here we All go. Right. So now they get a whole big opening right there. Yep. Oh, they did so good for my first time. I was okay. so nervous. You look like a pro. And that's it. We replaced, we put on the second brood frame, moved up one of our things. So now they'll fill up that box up on top. Yep, and then once they get that like 80% full, then I think we will put a uh, honey super on top of that. And that means honey for us. Yes. All right. But I'm ready to get out of this thing. I have sweat in my eyes. <laughs> All right. How hot is it in there? Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm glad I didn't have to wear one. It's like I got a shower. My face is so wet. <laughs> it's in my eyes. But I will say it went so good. I was so nervous and that went so well. Oh, I'm so happy. You did good. Beekeeper. You are officially a beekeeper. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Alright, so we're still learning. But uh, so far so good. Hopefully we can get our own honey this year, maybe. But... Uh, Hope you liked this video. If you did, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more uh, beekeeping videos. And until next time, thanks for watching.